Ellerby is back in again. And anytime the boss man is in, you know, a big announcement is coming. Hello, Ellery. Yeah, big, fun announcement as we got uh, a couple Cowboys in the studio with us. Not Dallas Cowboys, so don't don't get riled up quite yet. I, this I don't be- Emmett I don't Smith believe. and Michael Irvin, I'd leave right <laughs> I know. now. I, I don't believe they're that kind of Cowboys. This is going to be very fun Cowboys to talk to. Coming up at the Pirate Radio football kickoff party, we already announced Blake Prohl will yes. be there. Excited about that. And uh, also, very happy, Ellerby to announce that should have been cowboys will also be performing at the pirate radio football kickoff party we got jerry coyle and um his sidekick with a funny name mark <laughs> pascal uh joining us uh, great to see you guys jerry mark welcome in hello hey clip what's up man it's uh mark i love looking at you in that cowboy hat well it's my new style <laughs> i'm bringing it back it's beautiful man it's it's- jump with the horses out front or the back? <laughs> <laughs> we do have beer for the horses whiskey for my men of course uh i'm gonna see how many country references i can do that one in this was segment. from the 2000s we don't Damn. oh you, you, uh, you're not familiar strictly with that 90s country are you clip. old enough clip to know about the 90s let's boot scoot boogie <laughs> i will say honestly i am not a country music fan but the 90s country i'm all over give yeah. me some some joe diffie and brooks and dunn and, and it's yeah. a fun era like yeah people don't even know they like it and they like it like i have several friends like you that are uh i don't i like to say you're pre-country because eventually everybody likes country you're just pre-country oh okay i like but that you grow of, into it exactly i have okay. a bunch of pre-country friends and they're like ah, i don't really like that and then i'm like you should check it out and they go you know what that's actually pretty cool. <laughs> and uh I, yeah it's gonna I be enjoy. fun coming up at the pirate radio football kickoff party real quick LRB, can i just uh talk about jerry and mark and what i associate them with musically yeah absolutely let's, so let's mark I, I watch mark uh, growing up not that you're that much older than me but like i just remember you with other band names i don't know if we can say those names fine by me uh but spare change yep. um jupiter, jupiter jones, jones. Yep. Um, and others but at my after my graduation i remember going over to uh what was it city hotel and bistro yeah you guys packed it out and uh it was a great night and i associate you musically with that jerry i've seen him a, a ton of times too but at a pirate radio party yeah both the guys have played the pirate radio party mm-hmm. they're playing purple rain and like that's a tough one to start with 1980s not 1990s that's nor right. country but hitting <laughs> <laughs> hitting the end of purple rain those sounds that prince makes yeah yeah. it oh, sounded like up, he yeah. was in the freaking building so that's what i remember jerry from musically so i'm very excited to uh see these guys we're play. gonna get some new associations yeah to yodels that's Maria. right i do a little uh eat a little yodeling Brooklyn that's right we yeah. got the yodel sound going <laughs> so tell us uh tell us about the new band here because i mean clip just dropped a lot a lot of the bands that you guys have been in before i know jerry was in the main event band as well that has played the party originally when we started this thing many many moons ago and mark you were jupiter jones played the party yeah. with the main event band so you, you guys have kind of come together uh tell us about this this new band and uh, we're excited to have you on august 29th sure well um you know i was playing my solo stuff and mark wasn't really doing as much music uh nowadays and um i don't know we kind of got together and just started talking about wanting to do something we didn't really know what you know and um country music as you know east north carolina is kind of where it's at um and but we're not really fans of the current country um mark loves 70s country waylon jennings and merle Haggard and all that stuff and i do too you know but uh we didn't feel like it uh really applied to the mass audience so we were just like man well 90s country is kind of where it's at even if like clip you know even if you don't like 90s country you still know 90s country you know and, and you don't even know you love 90s country you don't even know you know right. 90s country and that was something we both settled on and decided um and nobody's really doing it it's kind of having a moment too like there's a lot of retro 90s country stuff happening a lot of yeah. stuff in the 90s happening right that's, now yeah, 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 yeah 90s, that's period. True. 90s period that's exactly it's right. resonating with all the 45 to 55 yeah. year old people feel old to be quite honest <laughs> well, sure. i like it's it. good that you are old i guess i reckon i liken it to uh in the 80s the 50s was big they, right. all the diners and stuff were coming yeah, around in the 80s yeah. so you just kind of shift that and now you got stuff coming back from the 90s people wearing denim jackets and everything it's kind of crazy yeah so. and you guys uh kicked it off y'all played at the buck recently had a huge success uh, a lot of great feedback uh, a lot of our staff here actually saw you there yeah and uh, chandler what uh, do you remember anything from the set list i know uh we every time bryce williams comes on we that was definitely played yeah uh we sing oh, that brand one. new man brand new man, <laughs> brand new man. Uh, can y'all give us a little um, rendition real quick of what bryce's song is oh i mean shirley can play it shirley, shirley yeah uh, featuring cooper greer can you hit bryce's intro real quick this one, is kind of a two, test for three, us four. i saw the light i was bad 
hypnotized by the fire in your touch and the flame in your eyes. I'm born to love again. I'm a brand new man. Can we tour with you guys? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope that ours is a little more uh, on the edge. Yeah, I mean, you guys what don't really feel threatened anymore by, by a new what is this word? I mean, what did you expect? <laughs> Mark, what did you expect? Really? Um, no, but I, I, I saw him at the Buck not too long ago, and the Buck was just packed out. A lot of people enjoying the songs. I think it's going to be the same way at State Theater. Heck yeah. Absolutely. So August 29th, uh, and you guys, uh, have a, y'all going to be back at the Buck yeah, coming up soon? Yeah, if you want to check us out before that August 29th, which is obviously the best time to go, but June 7th, back at the Buccaneer Music Hall in Greenville, and... But in June 28th, June 28th down at Jackson, uh, Moorhead in Moorhead City. Mm-hmm. So uh, it's a lot of folks I know travel down to the Carteret County area. Yeah. So that, that's awesome. And uh, of course, August 29th will be our big football kickoff party. And uh, we're going to collaborate with Blake Prohl with you guys yeah, that night cool. uh, just on American Idol. I mean, we announced that on Monday. We're excited. He and, mentioned the other day, like he does pop, but he has a country interest. So I yeah. think it'll be a good crossover there. Nice and I think he even sang a few country songs during his during his American Idol run. So that, that should be a lot of fun. But the state theater has been a great venue for us the last couple years and i know you guys uh will will fit right in and yeah. uh, have people yeehawing up at the front oh, yeah. of the stage anything else people should know about uh, the band before we uh get rocking and rolling on the 29th of august for one for me i don't wear this shirt other than when the band is uh playing you just put it starts so back know, up in your closet this is literally from the brooks and dunn collection it says it right on the tag actually when i first saw the photo i was like dude that is that's that's totally Brooks and Dunn. You were like, yeah, I got it from Quite the Brooks and Dunn they collection. They had a shirt line from the 90s. That is awesome. Brooks and Dunn. Yeah. Jerry's got the Garth Brooks look going. I got more of a Garth Brooks thing going on. <laughs> you know, the Thunder Rolls and all that. Is that so so y'all, I guess y'all play some Garth? Uh, during oh, yeah. Garth. It, yeah, Garth Brooks, Toby Keith. Alan Jackson. Alan, Alan Jackson. Jackson. Uh, Joe Diffie, like you said. I mean, yeah. if, if they were big in the 90s, uh, we play them. All right, what's your top? country song you play and mark then what's yours that we play yeah Ooh, that's a really good question i'm gonna have to I think could about probably that. say brand new man that one's it's really such a, good yeah it's a like, high energy upbeat. song yeah it, yeah it's a really good one that is a good one uh i like uh probably something like that uh tim mcgraw it's a tim mcgraw song we do, like to, we do a couple tim we McGraws, do a couple yeah. tim mcgraws and yes. i know jerry can can hit the high ones and you talking about my maria i'm ex- i'm looking forward to hearing that now because so we started making our song list, and I'm like, I don't think we can play 14 Brooks and Dunn. <laughs> yeah. I feel like we need to pare it down a little bit. They just have so many, so many slamming hits. It's, yeah, it's hard. Yeah, to you, you could do a whole show for of George Strait, Toby Keith, Brooks and Dunn, and just do a whole show. Yeah, and maybe Garth, like four artists, yes. like ten songs a piece. By so the way, try to be more, a little more variety. Once we do go on tour with you guys, Chandler and I, we already have a name. We're Broken Dumb. <laughs> and we do Brooks and Dunn hits. So we do like a little uh, comedy yeah. opening. Sure, yeah. With uh, awesome sounding singing as well. Yeah. yeah, there we go. We may have you guys signing uh, autographs out front. And when the, I the squeeze in the Mark shirt, that'll be fun there for the go. crowd. Yeah, there you go. So you guys should have been cowboys. Should have been right. cowboys. Yeah, it, off Toby Keith. Right. Like, yeah, yeah. So we we were we were flirting with another name, um, and we're kind of looking into it. And there's a band in idaho or something like that that already had that had the name we were talking about and i never really thought about that there's a million band names so you got to like mm-hmm. scour through to make sure the yours idea, is unique the idea being you want someone to hear the band name and know what you are yeah like when you're a tribute act i don't like there's tribute acts and it's some random thing and they're like yeah you know they're a they're a, a shania twain band but, but this has nothing to there's do no with it i wanted to say like should have been cowboys toby keith 90s country there pretty easy go. to put together I like it. Guys, looking forward to it. Thursday, August 29th, State Theater. We'll uh, release details of when tickets go on sale and uh, all the fun other events we're going to have around the party. And uh, give the dates again of uh, the Buck and, and Jack's down in Moorhead. So we'll be at the Buccaneer Music Hall on June 7th here in Greenville and then down at Jackson Moorhead City on June the 28th. And then obviously at the State Theater for the Pirate Football Kickoff Party, April 29th, Thursday. August 29th. August, why did I say April? Yes, I am. We're, we're gonna have to kick things off right to, to reverse the curse of the two and ten last year. So yeah. we're having, yeah, having you guys right. a lot of responsibility. Right. You, yeah. off on you, the right foot. you guys yeah. got got to got to bring the bring the heat on uh, that Thursday Will night do. to kick off that weekend. After ECU beats Norfolk State, you can take full credit for that. That's right. <laughs> All the momentum, <laughs> All us. carried over. You're welcome, uh, Pirate Nation. <laughs> Mark, Jerry, uh, looking forward to it, guys. It's gonna be a lot of fun.